Today, everything is becoming mobile. We live in a world that people are constantly on the go and are running their chores everywhere. But there's one office tool that is still stuck behind that hasn't changed in the past decade and isn't mobile. We're talking about the printer. We looked at printers today and we saw big bulky boxes with the printed inside moving from left to right. And then we thought, why not just take the printed out and put it on a robot? When we first started thinking about creating the printer, the most important thing for us was that it should be small. We knew we had to utilize every single inch. We wanted a pocket-sized printer that can print on any size of paper, precise images. We want people can take it everywhere and use it uh, not only in the office or at home. The printer's cover is made of polycarbonate with a glossy finish. We have two options. One is in Mars black, and the other is titanium white. I started working on the mechanical configuration, how it will look inside and how to configure the motors so it will be as small as possible and as accurate as possible. We had to keep it small. Everything was designed prior to building on the computer. We have uh, initial uh, mechanical prototype. We have our initial code. It's about 10 by 10 by 8 centimeters. Our initial prototype is aimed for grayscale images and text. The prototype aims for printing a page on under a minute. We are using a special uh, Bluetooth protocol which allows us to be able to print from any device. That means that no drivers will be needed. It will print on a regular A4 paper. If you have multiple pages, it will hold and uh, it will tell you to change a page. StepCraft is the next generation of desktop creative tools. It will inspire you by allowing you to go from idea to reality in just minutes. We all have great ideas and bringing them to life is now possible for everyone. StepCraft is different because it can transform from one CNC machine into another in seconds. With over seven completely different interchangeable tools available, you'll never run out of possibilities and the machine will never become obsolete. Click Start and the machine will make it for you. It's never been easier to go from idea to finished product and no tool gives you more options or capabilities. You can use the 3D print head for rapid prototyping or to make thousands of useful projects that you can use every day. Turn your Dremel into a precision 3D carver and mill. The high power spindle makes quick work of materials like aircraft aluminum, carbon fiber, wood, and of course plastic is a breeze. The hot wire cutter makes working with difficult materials like foam sheets effortless and it gives professional results in seconds. StepCraft will change the way you think. We've all spent countless hours trying to make things by hand and manually holding a tool is far from precise and can often be dangerous. Whether you're a modeler, a business owner, or a parent looking to give your child the ultimate creative tool, StepCraft is the key to unlocking imagination, innovation, and success.
It's never been easier to draw your favorite shapes as a pancake than with PancakeBot. First, you import the image into the software. Then you trace over the outline. After that, you go back and fill it in. Once you hit print, PancakeBot draws your pancake onto the hot griddle. It draws the first lines you drew first, so those become darker. Then it comes back and does the fill. PancakeBot uses a special vacuum and pressure system that we've developed in order to control the batter flow. Three, two, one, zero, lift off! The coolest thing about PancakeBot is the fun of using technology to print your own food in the form of your favorite character or shape. PancakeBot is technology that inspires you to create, inspires you to make, and inspires you to play with your food. PancakeBot is also great for your brand. Whether you manage a hotel chain, an amusement park, or a small cafe, you can use PancakeBot to add a unique experience for your customers to remember you by. Robox has every system in place to print with the materials available in the market at the moment. We have a, a nozzle system which includes needle valves, so we're able to shut off the flow of plastic instantly. Uh, this means no more oozing, no more stringing as you move between parts, and it, no more bumps on the outside. This means perfect parts every time. Uh, we've also got a, a new extruder design that rather than relying on one feed wheel and a follower, we have two contra-rotating feed wheels that grab hold of the filament, ensure it never slips, always forces material to the head and reduces the chance of blockages. And not only that, the extruder includes a close feedback system, so we have an indexing wheel that monitors the, the filament moving into the extruder versus that that's coming out. So if there is any stall or blockage, the software knows straight away. As soon as it knows, it can stop the print. You can then intervene and fix any problem that, that may have occurred. Uh, and then the printer will resume from where it left off, resume from where it left off, something I don't believe has yet been seen. Never before has a 3D printer been offered with this higher specification at such a low price. In our head, we have a twin nozzle system. This has a 0.3 millimeter and a 0.8 millimeter nozzle. This means that you have a high resolution but low speed nozzle for completing the high quality surface finish and perimeter of the part. And then a much larger nozzle which is capable of filling the part resulting in print times of up to 300% greater than our competitors. Because we have a very rigid frame, we can operate the printer at much higher speeds than normal. And not only that, we have a Bowden tube extruder so that the extruder is kept separate to the weight of the head. This allows us much higher printing and travel speeds. Robox isn't just a stylish 3D printer. By simply removing the head, we can add much more functionality to our platform. So we're starting out with 3D printing, but we hope to move into 3D scanning, stylus cutting, die cutting, pick and place maybe for surface mount PCB assembly, and also into milling using simple materials such as balsa, foam, plastics, and maybe PCB tracks. The Robox platform really is endless. It's not just a 3D printer. The Robox project is well into its development. We have electrical engineers, software engineers, firmware engineers, and mechanical engineers all working hard to produce this product. We've had a lot of our tooling completed and have our first generation of PCBs manufactured. Here it is, our new production ready 3D printer, the one up. We have used industry standard proven technology and this is not a prototype or incomplete kit. It does include everything you see here, everything you need, and does not require any extra development. I'm happy to let you guys know that this is gonna be here for the holidays. The working components of this machine utilize precision linear bearings coupled with brown and chromed eight millimeter rods that provide very smooth axis movement, industry proven acne threaded V axis screws for accurate positioning, and laser cut black melamine 
panels provide a reliable structure and an appealing finished appearance. The cubed 1UP has approximately a 100 by 100 by 125 millimeter build area and uses an Anubis hot end for extruding 1.75 millimeter PLA filament. The electronics package consists of a 60 watt power supply and industry standard electronics that do have an output for a heated bed. Hello, my name is Michael Joyce and this is the B9 Creator, a high resolution 3D printer project. Now, if you're watching this video, you're probably already aware of the exciting opportunities that the do-it-yourself 3D printer market has afforded for artists, hobbyists, and entrepreneurs. The B9 Creator is an excellent machine to begin exploring those opportunities yourself. Or perhaps you already own a 3D printer, but you're not currently satisfied with the quality of the prints. Perhaps the complex or fragile parts you wish to print simply aren't doable with your current machine. If that's the case, I think the B9 Creator would be an excellent tool to add to your tool chest.